Hello, my battling brawlers. We are back at again with another uh, unboxing video today, as per usual. Um, this one will be on the Ventus Milius Ultra from the Wave 2 Ultra Bakugan of Armored Alliance. Um, I think this is one of the better Ventus Bakugan you can get in the game. I can't exactly remember his stats right now, and I don't know what his evolutions are like. Uh, but NM comes, you know, with himself. Um, two back of cores, ability card, character card, collectible training card, one instruction sheet, one toy battlings rule sheet. Um, other back gone in this wave are as follows. The Diamond Enoch, which I unfortunately do not have. And all of the other guys, which I do have uh, videos on if you uh, go want to check those out. Yeah. Um... Without further ado, let's just go ahead and get right, get right into it. Alright, so we're going to get this out. That was pretty nice. That just came right out. Uh, Anilius here. He does have a restraint going across. So you're just going to get out your scissors. And just... Come on. Snip it away. There we go. Push him out without breaking him. Oh, I thought I broke him for a second, but I forgot his wings just open a lot more. Um, all right. And then his Baku core is there. And let's get rid of that. All righty. So we have our Ventus Nilius Ultra right out of the box. Uh, first things first, we take a look at his Baku Gear cores. Not Baku Gear cores, just Baku cores. They seem to be a little stuck together. Oh no. Come on. There we go. Don't know why they were stuck together, but anywho. Uh, so it comes with a magic shield and a green fist. Uh, it comes with a plus 650 B power uh, magic shield, which is the best you can in the game. And then a green fist of plus 50 B power and one damage. Like, not not, not really any good. Um, so, yeah. Uh, now let's take a look at his package here. Before you get rid of the piece of tape every buddy loves. There we go. Alrighty. So the cards and instructions, we don't need this. Alright. Uh, his closing instructions, we'll take a look at those in a second. But for now, on to the cards. Uh, so he does come with the Winton and Trox Ventus uh, Gate Trainer guy. There. Uh, his character card, first off. Oh, yeah, no, that's really good. Base 800 B power with the, with this 650, you're getting to 1450 right there. That's pretty good. Yeah, it has one damage, but it's like a win and most of the time when you'll win it. That's pretty good there. Uh, then, then it comes with a Ventu Smashers uh, Baku Gear card for 200 cost plus 200 B power. Yeah, it's all right. Um, so, yeah. Now let's take a look at Ventus Nilius Ultra here. Uh, back of gear spots are on his legs here and here. And then you put the, this is the other stuff on the tail right up there on the magnet. Uh, his B power is located on the tip of the tail there, 800. Um, and yeah, it's pretty... Pretty much it. Uh, they do indeed only good on detail with his eyes. One is orange and one is yellow. If uh, you can see that, which is actually pretty nice. A little bit harder to see on camera, but this one is orange, this one is yellow. Which I find is nice. Um, yeah. Alright, so now we'll go on to closing him. Uh, for those who aren't sure, don't really know how. Uh, let's take a look at the instructions real quick. 
The massive, massive instruction sheet. Okay. Alrighty. Uh, so first off, we're going to have his Ned heads come back into his neck, and then his neck is going to go into his body. Uh, the feet are going to go up. Um, then what, the tailpiece is going to come in a little bit. And then his wings are going to come in, and then the, 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 the tip is going to do that do that thing. Um, so yeah, it's Nilius, heads, go back, and then in, back, in like that. Okay, um, then the feet go up. And the tail piece is going to go in like that. Then the wings just come up in, and then the tip. And there you have uh, Nilius Ultra closed. Like so. All right. Now let's just go ahead and rolling him out and crashing him into my stuff. Uh, behind there. Uh, setup will change next year, uh, so I won't have this problem for long. Uh, so Bakugan Brawl, Bakugan Stand. Uh, yeah, the manual parts are indeed his heads, so you're just gonna have to turn, turn those around there. Now, with Somnilius, Somnilius, I believe, can pick up two yeah, just like that. Uh, you can get lucky with Nilius, and you can pick up two Baku cores, uh, which is pretty nice, uh, but like somewhat unlikely. Uh, but it is nice that he can actually do that. So, uh, so yeah. So let's just go ahead and uh, roll him out again, but this time backwards, uh, just to see if that really does anything different. Alrighty. So this is backwards now. Okay. Yeah, he still opened up. Um, but, you know, he kept hitting things. So that's... That is unfortunate, but that will all change uh, next year for me. Um, so, yeah. That's, uh, that's really going to be it for Ventus... Nilius Ultra. If I can get this to stand up, that would be pretty nice. Nope. Yeah. Come on. No. 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 Don't have that. Don't. Not you. Not you. You're not the main guy here. All right. So, uh, Ventus Nilius Ultra. My thoughts on him. He's pretty good. I recommend picking him up. Uh, just for those good base stats. Uh, if he does get the magic shield, 1450 right off the bat. That's pretty nice. I don't know of his evolutions. I don't have those booster packs in my country, so it's all irrelevant for me. And Ventus Pegatrix is the best thing <laughs> right now. Uh, for Ventus, anyways, in my opinion, because of what we actually have for playing thing wise. Anywho, um, in the comment section down below, let me know your thoughts on him. Um,. Like if you did enjoy the video, subscribe and turn that bell notification on uh, so you know when my next video goes up. And uh, remember, brothers, until next time, remember to stay safe, wash your hands, wear a mask, practice your rules. Um, yeah, you know, all that fun stuff. Have fun, keep on brawling. Until next time. Sayonara.